Hi, this is Andrew with FieldWire. Today, I'm going to go through how you can accept an invitation to a project if you are a new FieldWire user. Once you accept a project invitation, you can access the project on the FieldWire website and on the FieldWire mobile app. When you are invited to a project, you receive a pretty standard invitation email. I'll go ahead and locate it and open it up. You will see the name of the individual who sent you the project invitation, the name of the project, and a link to join the project. Let's click the link to join the project. This brings us to the sign up page on the FieldWire website. Here, I'll enter my first and last name, my email will automatically appear, and I'll also set my password. I'll use this password to log in to FieldWire in the future or on the mobile version of FieldWire. Now I'm able to log in. Let's switch over to the mobile version of FieldWire. You can download the mobile version of FieldWire from the App Store or from the Google Play Store. When you open the app, you'll use the same credentials from the sign-up page to log in. When you log into the FieldWire app for the first time, make sure that you're connected to Wi-Fi. You'll then see the project you were invited to under the Disabled Project section. Since I'm connected to Wi-Fi, I'll go ahead and choose to enable the project. When I enable the project, I download all of the project content to my iPad. The small blue loading icon near the top of the FieldWire logo indicates information is downloading. This may take a few minutes to load if you have been invited to a project with a lot of information. Enabling a project ensures that when I am offline, I'll still be able to access the project. If you have any questions about using FieldWire, I definitely recommend that you check out our Help Center. To access the Help Center, simply go ahead and type help.fieldwire.com in your URL bar on your internet browser. Then you'll be led to our Help Center. Chances are, if you have a specific question about a process in FieldWire, there's likely a help resource that answers it.